Hello there, do apologise for the lack of detecting videos lately. I've been extremely busy digging holes and making ponds. Now that that work's coming to an end for the end of the year, I'll be able to get out a lot more detecting and there'll be plenty more videos to come. But in the meantime, this is just a very quick collection of clips from the very small short hunts that I've been doing lately. This one was a really weak signal, approximately, oh, what's that, six, seven inches down maybe? And there's the imprint of a coin there. So there's obviously a coin in this hole somewhere. There he is. Oh, it's a silver as well. First dig and it's a silver. Look at that, I literally just stepped into the field. There's the style. Came over here, switched the detector on. And first dig, weak signal, and it's a 1925 sixpence. What a crack and start. <laughs> There we go, Let's see, George the Sixth Penny. That's not too old, 1944. Reasonable depth though, probably about 10 inches or so. How deep the hole is just to find that, to give a, a good signal, but they're, they're awful to track down. That's a George the Sixth Threepenny bit. Three pence from 1940. So James found this one with the Vista Gold and I'm not sure where it is but it was given a good signal. I went over it with the E-Track and it read 1242 both ways. And it's a spindle whirl, is it? Yeah, I think so, yeah, yeah. That's a totally unusual pattern, it's like noughts and crosses. Just flip it over. It's blank on that side. Just let's have a look at another look at the pattern side. That's awesome. We've never found one like that and it's a big one. What an unusual pattern, isn't it? Yeah. That's a good find. Well done. And here's an extra little coin. I actually found this when I was out with my son, James, who's in this video, but it was a little bit too dark to take a video, so I've just rubbed it gently, just to bring up the detail, and I'll show you this. Forgive the state of my hands, I've been painting a pond this morning. That is a George the Third Farthen. Not quite sure how well that's coming up. Seems to be okay there on the viewfinder. Georgius Three. Rex, it says on there, and on that side you've got Britannia, it's actually written Britannia across the top, and along the bottom it says 1754. So that's a nice old coin, and it's actually got quite a lot of detail on it as well. Normally you get these and they're just like flat discs, that was pretty good. 
hopefully I'll be making a lot more finds in the near future. Thanks for watching. Don't know what this is. It was reading towards the left of the screen, which is quite a strange place for a coin to read, unless it's a small hammered, and this isn't a hammered coin. Um, it's definitely detail on it. I don't want to rub it too hard in case I rub the detail off. That's a five pence, man. It's a decimal five pence. What an awful coin. Blah. I am not gay. I never have been gay.